All right, awesome. Now we're going to talk about scheduling from within the matrix. You can schedule from plans, but in the matrix, there are some great powerful features for you to do mass scheduling across the board. So instead of scheduling one week at a time, you can go ahead and schedule multiple things at one time. So what we're going to do before we even do that, we're going to come right over here. We're going to add a couple of plans just with needed positions only. We're going to add four of those. And we're going to see those populate for the months of January. We're going to hit add four. Now, as soon as those are added, it's going to go ahead and take us to the very first plan, which would be January 7th. And it's going to show those needed positions there. But we want to go ahead and bulk schedule. So let's go ahead and go to the matrix. We want to view the next four plans, including this one. So we're going to go ahead and select the matrix. We can see those needed positions populate across the board for first impressions and security. And what we can do is we can do a few different things. I can go ahead and select our positions and just schedule people manually for each week. I can go ahead and select here and bulk schedule people. So if I want to schedule everyone to a specific role, I can go ahead and do that. But I can also use our templates to go ahead and import to a specific role. So for January 21st, if I already know there are certain people that serve in these roles, I can come over here to the dropdown and select import and then go ahead and import from a specific template. So in this case, this is the third week in January. So I'm going to go ahead and uncheck this and just import the people that are scheduled to our security team and our first impressions. And I'm going to go ahead and hit submit. And as soon as I do that, anything that's in my template is automatically going to be brought over into the January 21st plan. We could see all of those people auto added, which is awesome. Let's do that one more time for January 28th. We'll go ahead and hit this drop down for uh, actions. We're going to hit import. And we have a template specifically for weeks two and four. So we'll go ahead and week, hit week two and four and just select our first impressions in our security. Hit submit. And watch those team members populate right away. So good. Now we want to let them know that they're scheduled. So from here, I can go ahead and select this email icon. And then it's going to pop open a modal where I can go ahead and let these team members know that they have been scheduled. So we can say, you know what, I just scheduled for uh, the last two weeks. So we're going to uncheck the 7th and the 14th. So I'm just going to send out the emails for the 21st and 28th. And we're only going to do it for first impressions and security. So we have 22 people in that list. We're going to go ahead and hit next. And you can customize this email. So if you want to let people know, hey, we're scheduling for the month of January, you can go ahead and accept or decline as soon as possible or enter in any block updates. So we're going to go ahead and send those out. And we're going to see those email icons disappear really quickly as those are being sent out. And that's how you can go ahead and schedule from the matrix.